Am I with the what? Are you with the Giddings Times and News? Nope. Who are you with? I'm with me. Okay, because we usually don't allow people to film our property and stuff. Okay, well, I won't go on your property and film it. Okay. I'll stay out here and do it. Okay, yeah, it ends at the road here, so if you don't mind. Appreciate you. Thanks. Alrighty. I'm sorry? You can't be filming sir, state property. Why not? Because it's state property. This isn't state property. Yes it is sir, this, the state owns this whole deal. I'm Mr. Gonzalez, superintendent of the facility. Uh, how you doing? Good, good. My name's David, I'm an instigative journalist. Okay. Um, well, and this property right here is public easement well, and, and it's accessible to the public to, to videotape. I mean, what's the purpose of you videotaping? You're making a more well, story? I, I'm doing a story, but if I told you what it was, then it would, it would kind of negate what I'm doing. Well, it is what it is. I mean, you know, you're still going to do your story. Yeah, but you might warn everybody about what I'm doing my story about, and that would kind of mess it up. Okay, well, we have nothing to hide. I mean, we run a I, I have nothing to hide. Right. I'm not hiding anything. I am, I am not giving you what I'm doing because I don't want what I'm doing to be known because that would compromise the, the, the story. I don't have a problem if you do it from this side of the street, but this is state property. Usually we don't allow anybody to come out here and film. Okay, well, I checked the boundaries before I came out here. Okay. 15 feet in is uh, public access. So basically up to that gray box right there, which is telephone service wires that run underground. Okay. That's, that's public easement out here. All right, sir. Okay. I, I mean, if you if you want to call Giddings PD, that, I mean that's fine. I'm I'm not adverse to talking to them, but I'm going to tell them exactly what I told you. No, that's fine. I'm gonna I'm gonna answer this call. Okay. All right. Thank you. Okay. No, I'm good. Okay, well, what are you doing there? Taking pictures. Kind of obvious. I got a camera in my hand. Well, well, uh, logic dictates you know that I'm taking pictures. Though? I know exactly where I'm at. It's the Giddings State School. Yes, sir. What is your name? I didn't give it. What is your name? I didn't give it. Okay. Would you mind moving on where you need to be at? I'm right where I need to be right now. Okay. I All didn't right. get your name? No, sir. Right now, I'm going to go and make a phone call to the administration. Let them know that you're out here. Okay. You're a state employee? Yes, sir. You on the clock? Okay. You're required to identify yourself. Yeah, that employee there failed to identify himself. He's working in his official capacity, wants to give me instructions, but he doesn't want to identify himself.
It's okay, I'll find out who he is. Hope you're not walking all the way out here just for me. Yeah, I am. That's all right. I need the exercise fix. Oh, <laughs> here's some, somebody else. I'm Sergeant Thurman. I'm with the Office of Inspector General. We're a division of the state police. Uh, my partner and I are assigned out here. And we just need to know kind of what you were up to. There are you will be about the fourth or fifth person that I've had to tell this to today. That's okay. That's okay because I'm state police, so you can tell it to me now. Yeah. Well, I, I don't he's, care who you good. are. He's I just. Good. Yeah. He's good. I think I don't care who you are. I'm just saying you're like the fourth person I've had to tell this to today. Okay. Yeah, we're, so we're I'm gonna... always real concerned about security here because we have all these youth on this campus. Mm -hmm. So we just kind of need to know who everybody. And, is. and that's reasonable. Yeah. I I told the other gentleman what I was doing. I guess he's like the director of the facility a, or something. Ro the, Ro the Rodriguez. The superintendent. Yes. So. Yes. The guy in the blue. So Accurate. You're, you are. What, do you have some credentials? Um, I do, but I, I really don't want to give them up. Uh, I'll tell you what I I'm doing. You mine. I, I understand, but you're <laughs> your state employee. It doesn't matter. I don't have to. Uh, that's not true, ma'am. That is true. Uh, okay, what I, I won't you, argue with you. you. Work for? I, I'm going to argue with you. Um, I don't work for anybody. Okay, okay. I'm, a, I'm an instigative journalist. Uh -huh. I'm out here working on a story. A story about. This, uh, I can't. I can't give you. JJD? I can't give you any more information than that. It would compromise my story. Okay. So, standing out here taking video of people driving in and out is going to help your story. Mm -hmm. Really? Mm -hmm. Did you know that today we had quite a few people out here? Is that why you were here? I. I have no knowledge of what was going on you here. Didn't see all those people that were out here? I didn't, didn't pay attention to. It. No, it has nothing to do with that. I didn't even know there was any kind of event going on. Well, let me 
me put it to you this way. We're not going to run you off or anything, but stay right here. Do not go on state property. Okay. Well, I'm not going to go on state property, even though as a resident of the state of Texas and a taxpayer, state I, property not, is my I'm property. Gonna, what are you, what are I, you, uh, I, I, I'm just going to tell you. Texas or something? No. Okay. No. Well, then I don't want to hear anything. Uh, no. I don't want to hear anything. Okay, well, listen to what I'm saying. Then I'll tell you what I'm going to tell you. That is state property. Okay, the state property begins where that line in the concrete is. Stay off I am not coming on state property. Stay I have away. made that clear to Come everybody on. that's, that's including this guy right here. I made it clear to him that I am not going to enter state property. I don't need to enter state property. I got a camera with 800 times zoom. How long are you going to be here? Until um, I'm done with what I'm doing. I, I can't tell you. I don't know. Once I've gotten what I'm here for, I'll be gone. you that it would compromise the story so do you have any identification because i want to check and see if you have any warrants or anything and you can go ahead and point the camera at me that's okay because it doesn't bother me i've been doing this a long time i'm not going to say anything that you can put on tv and make me look stupid do you have any id you already have do you have any id do you have a driver's license i have a driver's license may i see your driver's license you may not you're not going to identify. So you're failing to identify yourself to a peace officer. Who has identified himself to you as a peace officer? 3802 says I only have to identify myself if I've been lawfully arrested. No, you're no, not. Does not. not if you've been lawfully detained. No, sir. Oh, I'm being detained? We're talking to you, aren't we? Well, talking we to me to is... establish who you, who you are and why you're outside this secure facility. I mean... Talking to me is consensual contact, generally, unless you... Unless you okay. suspect me of committing a crime. Do you this, suspect this, me of this, committing a crime? This, this is what the deal is right here, okay? We know you've got your little camera on and you want to get on YouTube and all this other stuff. I, I understand I that. don't want to get on I YouTube. I understand that, okay? What we have here is a secure facility full of children that you cannot take pictures of, period. Are you alleging that I took pictures of the children? I am not. I'm just telling you you cannot. Okay, because she just said what I was taking pictures of. The, the staff coming and going. I'm just telling you what you cannot do. Okay. You cannot take pictures of those children inside that fence. If you do, you are violating, okay? There's all kinds of privacy laws and things like that concerned with those children. Okay, well, actually, what the Supreme Court rule has ruled is that anything I can see from the public right away, I can photograph, and that includes children. I can photograph you through your window at your house if you're dumb enough to leave the curtains open. But I'm telling you, I'm not here to photograph the kids. Okay. Have no interest in those kids at all. Okay. If you have no interest in the kids, why are you here? What did she just say? <laughs> so you're here to take pictures of people driving in and out? That is exactly what I'm here for. Okay. I, I know it's confusing to you. No, and when it's not the, when confusing to us. We don't get easily confused. It's just uh, sounds a little ridiculous, but I, I understand. Know. When the story comes out, then you'll understand. Uh, up to that point, okay. I can't give you any more information because it would compromise my story. Okay. Uh, if you want to stand out here and take pictures of people, on public calls, property, I'll stay on public property. You go right on ahead. I mean. If that's part of your story, then that's part of your story. It, it is the story. Okay. It is the story. So, I mean, you're on public property. It's like I say, as long as you don't cross that line right there. And not not going in there. My story's not in there. It's out the here. The Supreme Court did say you can take pictures, but they did not say you could take pictures of incarcerated children. Okay. They didn't say you couldn't take pictures of incarcerated well, children. Well, we can argue that in front of the can judge I, here in Lee I, County. They're, they're juveniles. They're poor. I, they're I, protected. I understand that. Okay. I'm not here for the kids. I'm not photographing the kids. have no interest in the kids. I've, I've explained that to you. I'll reiterate it again if you need to hear it. I am not here to photograph kids. Even though I believe I can, I would have to research the law before I did it because I'm not sure. So okay. I, well, that's off the table. We don't even need to worry about that. I'm here to photograph this stop sign. Stop sign. That is what I'm here to photograph. Well, sir, you <laughs> photograph that stop sign or you run out of film. Well, I it's mean, digital. Nobody uses it. Or digital or whatever. you Until you run out of memory on that stop sign. Okay. And, and, and as a courtesy, I will, I will ask you and give you the opportunity to tell me, you know, is there anybody that's going to drive through here that you would not want me to photograph? Uh, we can go up there and, and at, at the gate 
Yeah, I mean, no undercover there. people or anything like that. Well, there's another thing, too. Uh, if they're over there and you're photographing them over there and they don't want to be photographed, would that not be a problem? It, no, it's perfectly legal. Well, that's another one we could argue. Uh, uh, if it, I can't tell you. If we have somebody undercover, I couldn't tell you. Okay, I mean, I, I don't know who would be undercover yeah. here, but, you know, I'm just giving you the opportunity. If I, I'm, I'm a man of my word. If I tell you I won't photograph, if you specifically tell me some person would be compromised or harmed if I recorded them, even I would not if, do Even it. if there was, I couldn't tell you. Okay, that's fine. Oh, okay, well, <laughs> okay, I'm just giving you that well, opportunity. Like I said, if you want to stand here all day, videotape that sign or, or take pictures of that sign, you're on public property, just don't cross that line. Oh. That's, that's the only thing. There we go. And there should not be anybody else come out here and talk to you about this after this, okay? Okay. We're, you know, we're kind of the final authority on well, I kind of figured they'd send Giddings PD if they were really worried about me. Well, we're state police, so. Well, you're their police, but, no, you know. We're be actually state police. We're not their police. We're state police. You're DPS? No, we're not DPS. Well, she said Inspector General, so I figured you're part of DPS. Mm -hmm. TJJ, Office of Inspector. Oh, okay, I see. I got it. I got it. So you're actually, I, I got it. You're actually work for them and your certified peace officer. Actually, no. No, we're separate entities. We we're, <laughs> we handle criminal cases that occur on the property. On property is different, different facilities, things like that. Uh, we're a different thing altogether. We're, I'm, you know, what the ombudsman, independent yeah. ombudsman. We're kind of like that for them, and then the independent ombudsman's over everybody else. Okay. So. Well, my name is David. I'll give you that much. All right. And she gave me her business card. It's got a, an email address on it, I believe. I've already put it away, but it's got an email address on it. I will email you the story, and then you'll understand. That'll work, David. All right. All right, man. Like I say, just I'm, don't cross the I'm, line because then we got another problem. Right here. I'm not coming on property. All right. Be careful. Uh-huh. But do you mind if I check and make sure you don't have any weapons on you? <laughs> I mean, you could have already shot me in the head, but, you know, I'm, I'm not going to go in your pockets or anything like well, that. Well, I, I know what a Terry Frisk is. Just an outside Frisk, that's it. I know what a Terry Frisk is. I'll save you the trouble. I will tell you I am not armed, okay? I have no ill intent. I'm not here to harm anybody. That's not what are. I'm here. I don't believe you are. Okay, I, but I'm I not going to I'm not going to subject myself to a search because even if I were armed, it's legal in Texas. I, I understand that, and then you'd have to show me your concealed carrier or your c carry permit. Yeah. But the reason I ask is because this is a facility. I'm not, it, you know, I don't care if you got anything less than a firearm on you. Okay? I I don't have anything on me. Would that you mind opening your coat just so I can see? I, I will do that. Okay. okay. I will do that. But I am I'm not armed. Okay. I have nothing. Just so I can see. I got okay. nothing. Right, like I said, not here to hurt anybody. I just just take a picture of the stop sign. Doing your job just like we are. Okay. Phones and cameras. This in this day and age, a camera is more deadly than any phone you. I mean, uh, any gun you can find. You got that right. Okay, that, that's man. I appreciate you showing. I, I do. Like I told you, I'm taking pictures of the stop sign. That's it. Okay. I All appreciate right? you showing. All right.